continues for one of two men accused of robbing an undercover deputy, then shooting at law enforcement as they took off. Look at this right here. It all happened Monday afternoon in the parking lot of the Westfield Brandon Mall. It's in Tampa Bay's Twilon Nguyen shows you how a push to get illegal guns off the streets turned into a close call for deputies. Frank, good morning. As we can see here, the mall completely quiet. That scene has cleared and we are expecting it to reopen at normal hours today. But the most important takeaway from all of this is that nobody was hurt during all of the chaos. And I saw all the shops closing and unlocking the doors and locking yeah, themselves in there. It was it was hectic. Here's how it all went down. An undercover Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputy was working to get illegal guns off the street. You can see the transaction happening in the front seat of the deputy's car right here. Then the two men robbed the deputy at gunpoint. Other deputies watching the situation moved in and the two men started shooting at deputies as they ran away. Deputies were able to catch one of them, 19 year old Jordan Gracia, who's got quite a lengthy rap sheet. He has previously 26 felony charges already at the age of 19, 14 misdemeanor. And some of those charges include armed burglary, juvenile in possession of a firearm, carrying a concealed firearm. And today he'll have more charges to include armed robbery and attempt murder of a Leo law enforcement officer times four. They have not released the information about the second shooter, but police say they know exactly who he is and they're looking for him. But if they cannot find him, they will release the information to all of you to see if you can help them find this person. Again, they do know who he is, but they have not released his information to the public yet. And the mall Hill here will reopen shortly. All right, thanks, Twilan. We'll let you know as we learn more today.